Hey, what's up guys, it's Roy here. So today I have the Spigen Classic C1 MagSafe wallets here. Now these are pretty new. Uh, they were just released not that long ago from Spigen uh, and they were kind enough to send these out for review. Now you can see it comes in the three different colors which are the retro colors like they did with their classic retro case that they made for iPhones, which I did a review on and absolutely love those. Um, but uh, today let's talk about what you see here. So these are gonna cost you around 26, 27 bucks online on Amazon with Prime Shipping. So I'll link them down in the description if you're interested. Uh, so let's go ahead and get these bad boys out. So as far as the unboxing goes, this is the packaging that you get here. Uh, so as you can see here, you see the picture of the uh, MagSafe wallet there, classic C1, Spigen branding there, and up to three cards, which we will test here in just a minute, and MagFit for MagSafe. And then on the back here is just the extra uh, stuff if you care to look at it and read. But I've been using this one off and on uh, for the last couple of days. So it is not in its packaging like it came, um, but there it is. But I'll put that to the side and let's get the other colors out. So this one is the ruby color. So we'll get that out. And it comes in this plastic packaging just like their phone cases do. Right, and then last but not least, graphite, which is usually my go to color for most things when it comes to phone cases and accessories. All right, so there's all three colors. So, I'll kind of put them in my hand real quick. So, one thing I want to point out is obviously you got that retro style look, which looks awesome. Uh, the back has this very, very grippy material right here. Um, as you can see, it's already picked up some stuff just from my desk here, but it's right here and right here. And it literally, I mean, if you see when I have it on here, like I can't really push it hard. It, it literally just sticks. So uh, it's gonna help adhere a little bit better to the phones. But as you can see here, you have that, like I said, that classic retro look. Uh, this one is that cool greenish color. Well, actually it's called Bondi Blue, but uh, but yeah, it's like a greenish bluish color. Uh, and then uh, that's the look there. And then we can look at the Ruby one a little bit up close. So that's the look there. And then this is the graphite, which I like a lot. It's more plain Jane, but there is something to be said about this Bondi blue one. So let's slap it on. So as you can see there guys, adhered very, very quickly to my speaking case. I have the rugged armor currently on it. And I really like the look of this with this kind of combination here. And one thing I can point out guys is like if you notice, like I'm pushing pretty dang hard and it's not, I mean, it, there it finally moved but I have to put quite a bit of force for that to move. So that's something that should definitely be pointed out because a lot of times you'll put a wallet type of MagSafe case on the back of a phone case and it just starts slipping and sliding. And I mean, once you put this on, I mean, it it's pretty dang snug. But like I said, can I move it? Sure, if I push it, I can totally move it. But the point is, is it's got a very good grip, but that is the Bondi Blue. And let's take it off and let's slap on the Ruby color. And that's what that looks like. Okay. And Graphite. Which if we're gonna be honest, Graphite probably looks the best with the black phone case. Definitely a clean, just basic look. But I shouldn't say basic, cause it definitely has a cool look to it, but got some Spigen branding there as well. Um, but now that I have it on, I'm gonna take it off real quick and let's grab three cards, which is what I have. So when you push it in, they are very snug fit in there. Uh, they are not gonna fall out at all. Definitely not gonna do that. And then the way to get them out is you just push and then you can slide your cards out and you know, use whichever one you want, and then boom, 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 put them back in. There we go, and voila. Now you're on the go, and if you want um, you know, not to carry around a wallet and have something like this, then this is definitely 
a really good look and I really like that it's semi-translucent so you can kind of see the stuff back there which more and more cards are starting to have the numbers on the back not the front so if you have a debit card that has the numbers on the front it might be smart to potentially put it not on the outside of it so maybe put it back or in the middle or something like that but like I said then you got it on and you just slide your cards out and voila there we go so not bad at all really not bad at all so one thing I want to try just for jollies I, I don't think we'll be able to do it but I am curious if we are able to MagSafe charge I highly doubt we are able to but we can sure try so yeah definitely not but that's okay I mean obviously if you have this type of separation there's nothing for it to adhere to um, so yeah if you want to charge it then you definitely need to take it off and then charge it so uh, but yeah guys there we go there are the three new classic C1 uh, MagSafe wallets from Spigen and I gotta say I really really like these I think they look good I think they serve the purpose I think they have that nostalgic look that a lot of people are gonna like if you're an Apple you know fanboy or fangirl then you definitely are going to gravitate towards something like this uh, and it's not that expensive either so to give your phone a little bit of an extra pop and be able to keep your cards with you on the go instead of carrying a wallet or a purse maybe if you're on a run or something like that then I think this is a very good investment so hit the like button if you like the video if you loved it please subscribe Ring that notification bell for up-to-date content, so be safe, God bless, and we'll see you on the next one.